So, I found this super cool text-to-image AI tool that is 10 times better than Midjourney and 10 times easier to use than Midjourney. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to use this text-to-image AI tool that is very incredible. Now, if this is something that you're interested in, please come closer and let's dive in. So, before I go ahead and show you how to sign up on this platform, let me quickly show you how to use it. It's something that is very easy that even a five-year-old can use. It's super easy. All you have to do is to come over here and type in your prompt. So let's go ahead and try out this first prompt that I copied to my clipboard and click on generate. Two seconds later. So now you can see the amazing image that he created for us. This is super art. You can use this for art. You can use this for any project that you want. You can see how amazing and super cool this is. What? What? <laughs> Alright, so now that we have tested one prompt, let me quickly show you around. So when you come over here, this is where you set your dimensions. As you can see, it's super easy. You just use this slider and move to any dimension that you want. And you can see how it's going to look. This is 1152 by 768. So this is an amazing way to choose your dimensions as against the Blue Willow or Mid Journey that you have to now start putting AL, that's aspect ratio. Then you start thinking of the number 16 by 9, 2 by 3 and all that. So sometimes you might miss the number and you won't get the right aspect ratio that you want. But here it gives you exactly the same aspect ratio that you want. So let's go ahead and try out this aspect ratio and go ahead and click on generate and it's going to generate with that aspect ratio. No mistakes guys, this is so mind blowing. So now you can see it has generated the image with this aspect ratio. So here you can see the accurate aspect ratio and this is looking so lovely. If you come over here, you'll see negative prompt. We're going to test out this in the next prompt that I'm going to be using. You can add anything that you don't want to see in the image or any other thing that you wanted to exclude you just simply add it here and it's going to create an image without those things that you added here. Now, if you come over to the image that it has generated, what you're going to see here is download image. So this one, you simply download it to your file. By the way, you can access this platform on your mobile phone. It's very easy, super easy. And here you can see outpaint. So if you click on this outpaint, what it's going to do is it's going to give you a wider shot of the image. Very incredible, very, very incredible. We're going to be trying this out now. So I'm going to click on outpaint and it's going to give us a wide shot of the same image. It's super nice. So you can see what it created here. So this one is a closer shot and this one is a wider shot. And you can see how incredible incredible it looks. How cool is this? And then for this button, it's used to generate variations. So you can just click on this button and use it to generate variations of the same image that you like. So if it generates like four images and you like one and you want it to create variations of that same image, all you have to do is to click on generate variations and it's going to give you like four more variations of that same image. This is so incredible, very easy to use. It's no longer all those coding language you have to direct direct it so what to do you have to click it you know all those things very complicated now it has given us different variations i don't know how else to describe this platform it's just so incredible now it has given us four variations four cool amazing super hot variations of the same image as you can see here how awesome is this so now if you like any of the variations all you have to do is to click on download to download it to your device and you're good to go. So we're going to go ahead and download all the images. So I'm going to be giving you this prompt. I've prepared a sample prompt for you and all you have to do is to just copy and paste and learn from the prompt and see how you can just change some things and add your own words or add whatever you want to see in the image using the guide of the prompt. So it's more like a prompt example. So all you have to do is to change one of the words and it's going to create a different thing for you but using the same guide. If you're a new subscriber, I'm sure you don't have access to that prompt yet because I've shared it on this channel before. I'm going to make that available to you so that you can use it to create your own amazing prompts and your own amazing images. Very cool. So if you want to zoom into the picture, all you have to do is to click on the picture and you have a brother look at the picture. This is so incredible. You can see how crisp it is. It's better than Blue Willow. It's better than Mint Journey. It's better than a lot of text to image AI tools that I've tested out over the course of this AI uprising. So it's amazing. And that is why I wanted to bring it to you guys. So if you're not subscribed to this channel, you're going to miss out on all these incredible tools that I keep sharing on this channel. If you want to learn digital skills that will help you win in life, that will help you make seven figures, then do well to subscribe to this channel and turn on the post notification so that whenever I upload new videos like this, 
you'll be the first to know, first to watch, first to implement, and first to cash out. You understand what I'm saying? So go ahead and subscribe to this channel and join the community. Next thing I'm going to do is that I'm going to try out another prompt. So I have my prompt here. This is the prompt that I was telling you about. I have long list of prompts and I keep updating it over and over again. So when I first shared this prompt, I think it was about 30, but now it's around 50. So I keep updating it. So by the time I give you access to the link, all you have to do is to click on the link every time that you want. And you have new set of prompts to try out. And if you love what you see, all you have to do is to just make some changes here and there in the type of image you want to see and you're going to see amazing, amazing image. So the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to copy this one right here and I'm going to hit on copy and come over here and paste it here. Okay. And to use this feature, the negative prompt, all you have to do is to give it a prompt, like tell it what you don't want to see in the image and it's going to create that for you. And in this case, I'm telling it, I don't want to see a purple hair, please, no purple hairs. <laughs> all right, so, and then you can say uh, blur, blur as well. I don't want to see any blurry image and you're going to go ahead and click on generate. So let's check another dimension like this one, 1088 by 896. And I'm going to go ahead and click on generate. Don't click out yet because I'm going to reveal the name of this platform. And not just that, I'm going to show you an amazing cool feature that this platform has. It's going to blow your mind. So it has created the image of the body that I wanted it to create. And you can see that it's amazing and it comes in the dimension that I wanted it to create the image. No mistakes, guys, it's very incredible. And you can see that this looks super real, super, super realistic. And I'm going to go ahead and save this. I think I might even use it for the thumbnail. What do you guys think? Is it okay for the thumbnail? Did you like the thumbnail? Because obviously by now you must have seen the thumbnail. So let me know if you like the thumbnail, if I'm going to eventually use this or use the previous ones that I've downloaded, right? So I'm going to go ahead and save this. Now I'm also going to save this. This is amazing, amazing, amazing. It tried its best to avoid the purple, but it still gave us one with just a slight tint of purple. Not too purplish, but just a slight tint, but it's okay. We have three variations that are very good. So all I have to do, if you want to replicate this, or if you want another variation, like I told you earlier, all you have to do is to click on this to create another variation. But we're not going to be doing that because I have another prompt that I want to quickly show you before I show you an amazing feature that this platform comes with. We are going to copy this and we'll come over here and paste it here. And here, I'm going to just remove all this and put text here. And the next thing I'm going to do, I'm going to use a wide, wide, dimension, like a wide dimension, like a movie style kind of dimension, right? So I'm going to go ahead and click on generate to generate this amazing image that is going to blow your mind. <laughs> now it has created the image for us and you can see this looks so amazing. So you can see no text, it didn't add any text for us and you can see it's so amazing and super realistic. Gosh! <laughs> so I'm going to be using this as the thumbnail as well. I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to try it out and see how it looks eventually at the end of the day. These AI tools are incredible. And one year from now, I can't begin to imagine how things will be, how crazy things will be. So this is why you need to make sure you learn the prompting, you learn how to use the AI, you learn the different AI tools that exist. Even if you have a nine to five job, it's very, very essential that you know how to use all these AI because it's going to save your job. Trust me, it's going to save your job. And by the way, if you're getting value from this video already, please go ahead and like this video so that more people can see it and benefit from it just the same way you're benefiting from it right now. Now, the next thing I want to show you first before I show you that amazing feature is to show you how to use this prompt. Because initially, before I found out this platform, I actually created this prompt for Mid Journey, but I don't want to alter it because a lot of people are already using it in Mid Journey and Blue Willow copy without this one, okay? Without the AR, AR means aspect ratio three by two. So do not include it because you can literally select your dimensions here. Now, for the big review of the amazing feature that this platform has is gives you the opportunity to upload your picture unlike Mid Journey that most of us don't even understand. It took me two weeks 
to understand how to upload picture on mid journey and use the picture to create amazing amazing image right but this one is very easy and all you have to do is to come over here upload image click on upload image and it's going to open your your folder your device or whatever wherever you save your image and click on this image and you're good to go you have your image here so whatever you tell it to create is exactly what it's going to create because whatever you give it is what you're going to get garbage in garbage out <laughs> all right so here right now i'm going to just use a simple prompt turn this image to a pixel style and here you can see it has created a pixel style of this image using this simple prompt that i just used now how cool is this now you can see that it has created amazing pixel style and you can check <laughs> emotional damage i don't look like this do i look like this let me know in the comment section if this looks like me <laughs> one bit i no 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 they biffing i think they're biffing me right <laughs> they must be biffing me because i absolutely do not look like this but you understand the point and the time for the big reveal is here so all you have to do to sign up for this platform is to come over to your browser and type in lexica.art Hit on enter. To sign up, all you have to do is to click on get started and you can simply sign up with your Google or your normal email address if you have a yahoo.com or a hotmail or live.com or whatever it is or your personal email, .yourname.com. Just go ahead, put your email here and continue. That's all. <laughs> that's, that's all you need to do nothing else sign up and use it do you know with the free plan that comes with this platform you can make a lot of money for yourself and after which you can then start paying for the platform and you're good to go because you're already making money with it and if you want to learn how to make money with this platform all you have to do is to go ahead and click on this video to learn how you can start a seven figure business with this platform but if by any chance you have seen this video this is the next video that youtube recommends that you watch on this channel so go ahead and watch either of the videos and thank me later see you on either side